have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Destiny. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back to the family. This week's video is another journal with me, but since it's the month of December, I figured why not make it Christmassy and festive inspired. So that's what we're doing this week. And I'm gonna show you guys my finalized spread for the month of November 1st. So you guys can see what a finalized spread looks like. Of course, I am filming this a few days before December. So the last few days are blank, but Bear with me, you guys get the picture. And then I'm gonna show you guys my sketched out December spread and then show you the coloring and filling in process, which in my opinion is the best part. And then, yeah, you're gonna see a lot of time lapses, a lot of fun activities. And I finished my Bujo. After finishing the December spread, literally I have no more pages and I finished my bullet journal for the month of, for the month, for the year of 2021. So I'm very happy with it. And if you guys wanna see a full flip through, let me know because I can definitely do that for you guys. But I did order a new one and I'm gonna show you guys that new one in January once it arrives. So without further ado, let's just get into this month's spread and my last spread for the year of 2021. All right, so let's jump right into my November spread for this year and I was so excited to get into it because I actually went outside and got these leaves from my front yard and obviously they're coming apart or whatever but I think it looks so cute and so authentic so this is the first page pumpkin spice and everything nice here's my little schedule here's my fall playlist if you guys want some of these songs I'm going to put them right here on the screen so you guys can bop with me <laughs> and then here is my habit and mood tracker pretty straightforward had a pretty good month and then i have my self-care menu and reflection page obviously some of these pages are blurred for my privacy but you guys get the picture i just like showing my previous month so you guys can see what it looks like all filled out here's my first week my second week i had a lot to think about as you can see here is my next week this is Thanksgiving week. Here's the past few days. Obviously this month has not finished when I'm recording this, but this will get filled out within the next few days. And then here's my dump and I added some photos that I took this month just to keep some type of memory of things that were going on. And then here's some more pictures. I'm definitely gonna write around this as well. Just reflect on a few things. And then, last but not least, we're getting into December. So I know it looks freaking crazy, but you guys know that once I color everything in, that's when this thing comes to life. So this is just a sketch. Here's my um, month of December. And I'm just gonna put like the month as a calendar here and then put my monthly goals right here on the side. Here's my Christmas playlist and my habit tracker. These are supposed to be candy canes and I, look, I know they look a little crazy, but let's see if I can fix that a little bit. Here's my mood tracker and then I have ornaments down here on the bottom so that I can just fill those in as I go throughout the month. And I did get a lot of this um, inspo off of Pinterest, so I highly recommend checking that out if you are running into some type of creative rut for your bujos. Here's my winter self-care. And I just did these doodles and I'm going to color them in as I see fit. Really cute. And then here's my brand collabs and posting schedule. These are going to be like Christmas lights. Here's my first week. My second week. I'm going through this pretty fast because you guys will see all of this at the end anyways. Here's my next one. Here's my next. Here's the last few days of the month. My birthday is on the 31st, so I'm really excited to see what I end up writing down for this day. And then last but not least, I have my reflection page. I'm just gonna write everything down here just to reflect on things that happened this month and changes that I wanna make within the new year because obviously 2022 is coming up. And then here I have my 2021 snapshots pages. And here I'm just gonna print out some Polaroids of some special moments that happened throughout this year and just post them here. And then I'm done with my first bullet journal 
and I know it looks freaking crazy but I'm honestly so proud of myself this is the first year that I tried this out and I actually kept up with it and I'm so happy with the results so let's see how this month's Boudreau comes out if you guys want to see how the finished product looks just keep on watching and enjoy the time lapse that's gonna happen <laughs> Gotta love this Christmas, but it ain't with me I watch the snow falling down like it's Rack City Back to my hometown, back to the whiskey Back to texting all your exes on Xmas Eve And I'll be there, yeah, I'll be there With your hoops and your fucked up hair And even though you got another man You could put your bubble goose on my one night stand, yeah Put up the lights there Like a snowman in my night airs Pine needles and marijuana in your hair And I swear these nights ain't they rough when December come around Tis the season of the cuff Keep my mind out the gutter Make food with extra butter Make do with something other than you Another lover so These reunions and black liver Fridays We lost in nostalgia If I had it my way I'd roll down the window of this Nissan sleigh Soup up everyone I never get to see these days Put the house party together Let the champagne rain Maybe the world's gone bad But the Hennessy ain't Maybe we all gone mad Maybe the news all fake But see the crew's all here, so let your homeboy paint I've been around these states, you know the red and the blue I know we all just trying to get through yeah. She gotta love this Christmas, but it ain't with me I watch the snow falling down like it's Rack City Back to my hometown, back to the whiskey Back to texting all your exes on Xmas Eve And I'll be there, yeah, I'll be there With your hoops and your fucked up hair And even though you got another man you can put your bubble goose on my one night stand yeah. You can put something new up into my lifespan Resolutions never holding, babe, I don't like plans I could lose a couple nights under these old street lamps I could do without the drama, hope my wish list lands We gon' sip the coffee in the morning With some Baileys up on it, like the rain coming down I'm glad it ain't California, gets a little bit colder We could build us a snowman, put a blunt in his mouth And flip up the Toyota, and we ride up to the mountains With the North Face on lounging, no court dates or orange Face a poor taste, we out this good year reindeer under candy paint, staring, kissing joints under mistletoe, feeling safe here. Ride till the wheels fall off this bitch, or at least until December 26th. I've been around these states, you know, the red and the blue. No, we all just trying to get through. She gotta love this Christmas, but it ain't with me. I watch the snow falling down like it's Rack City. Back to my hometown, back to the whiskey, back to texting all your exes on Xmas Eve, and I'll be. I'll be there, yeah, I'll be there With your hoops and your fucked up hair And even though you got another man You could put your bubble goose on my one night stand, yeah You'll be gone in the morning So stay here for the holidays I get what you wanted And that's real for the holidays Gone, gone in the morning So stay here for the holidays I get what you wanted it's real for the holidays Split up into by you now, and I don't know how to feel, but 
I won't run my mind is split up in two about you now About you Now for our final flip through. This is our month of December. I absolutely love how this came out. And this paper that I used here is reused from some packages that I got recently. So if you're looking for some old paper or something to just make your bujo a little bit more lively, I highly recommend to just try and do that. Save some money and also use some of the things that you might just end up throwing out without thinking about it. So this paper definitely did come in handy. I absolutely love it. Here's the second page and this is my schedule. Of course, I wrote Christmas Eve and Christmas into there and my birthday's on the 31st. So I'm really excited about that and this is what it looks like all colored in. So cute. Definitely gives me Christmas vibes. Here's my Christmas playlist and habit tracker. So cute. Obviously I went a little bit overboard with the red and green for Christmas but hey you gotta be festive right? So this is what it looks like. Here's my next page with my mood tracker. So cute. I ended up coloring everything in and leaving the lines blank for my ornaments and I'm just gonna fill that in as the weeks progress. Here's my winter self-care menu. Obviously, this is a little bit more simple than the rest of my pages, but I think it's still really cute. Of course, my doodles are not professional because, you know, I just wanted to make them regular. The next page I have is my brand collabs and posting schedule. So cute. This is a picture from Manhattan with the snow falling. Not sure if you guys can see that. But then I have some gingerbread men and some lights. A little bit of Stranger Things vibes, but I absolutely love it. And I'm just going to fill this in as the month goes along. Here's my next page. Same thing with the lights, but now I'm just starting off my week. So this is December 1st through 5th. Uh-oh, just kind of attached itself. Oh no, I just ripped it. Anyway, stuff like this happens all the time. I lost a piece of paper, but it's okay. Here is my second week. I apologize for all the eraser shavings around here. I was going ham on this one's boob gel. Here is the 6th through the 11th, another printout from Pinterest. My grandmother gave me this tape. It's not washi tape, but I used it as washi tape and I just glued it down. It's like little pine cones and little berries. So cute and it has some gold accents, which really adds to it. Here's my next week with a little Christmassy door and I'm just gonna fill this in. Here's my next week. I just blocked off the middle part and I wrote it's the most wonderful time of the year and then Saturday is Christmas so I put Merry Christmas, another gingerbread man, a snowman, a Christmas tree, a reindeer, and a bow. So cute. Pretty simple. Here is my last few days of December into New Year's Eve, which is my birthday. So cute. And then here's my reflection and 2021 snapshots pages. Obviously this looks really blank, but I'm gonna be printing out Polaroids and attaching them to these pages. So it's definitely gonna come to life. I'll show you guys what that looks like in January's Bujo. And this is some ribbon that my grandmother gave me. It's actually really hard to glue down because it's a really thick, Piece of fabric but nonetheless I think it looks pretty good here is my next page of 2021 snapshots here I added some felt snow and some gold twine I'm not really sure what this is but it's gold and it's really pretty so I put it in there and here is my next page again with those pine cones and golden little accents and I just made it kind of a basket weaving 
design here so I can just paste photos on top and it looks really pretty. And last but not least is my last two pages. I put the last bit of the fabric on this side with a little quote that says, don't wait for the opportunity, make it. And then a last little saying here is one step at a time. And then I added some more scrap paper so that it just makes the pictures pop out a little bit more. And I've officially finished my first bullet journal of the year and I literally filled in every single page. I'm so incredibly proud of myself. If you guys enjoyed this month's spread, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel. It definitely Definitely helps me out to continue to make content for you guys while you're at it make sure that you don't forget to hit that little notification bell so that you're notified every single time I post a new video this is literally my last bujo of this year and if you've been following me on this journey since my first bujo video on my channel I absolutely love you and I'm pretty sure my creativity has blossomed since starting this so if you are on the fence about starting a journal I highly highly recommend it and keep your eyes peeled for my next bujo when I start my new journal I'll see you guys next week in the next video. Bye!